Hi friends, it is a simple way to solve harmonic problems using your calculator Casio FX991 MS. This is the problem given to you. Find the first two harmonic of the Fourier series from the following table. X values are given in radian and Y values here it is real. And you know very well you will cancel this last term because the term is repeated again y value is repeated so you exclude the last value this is your Fourier series f of x equal to a naught by 2 plus summation n runs from 1 to infinity a n cos n x plus summation n runs from 1 to infinity b n sin n x when you expand this summation you get this a naught by 2 plus a 1 cos 1 x plus a2 cos 2x plus a3 cos 3x and so on b1 sin 1x plus b2 sin 2x plus b3 sin 3x so on you have a formula to find your constant a0 a1 a2 a3 b1 b2 b3 and so on these are the Euler's constant see a0 is given b1 b2 all these are given so here m stands for the terms so when you see this tablet column how many terms are here 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 this term is you exclude exclude this term because the y value is repeated so we have only 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 terms right now this is your calculator how to calculate my a1 what is your a1 you have to calculate this y cos x so instead of putting y value, x value and so on, you can e simply easily use this alpha button and find it out. Press alpha and then your y button. Right? So the formula here is y cos x. So using alpha, press y and then press cos, then press alpha with plus x so that you get a formula y cos x will appear on your display of the calculator now it is very simple press this cal in your calculator that will show you what is the y value and x value x value substitute y value there press equal to then it will ask for x value substitute x value and just press equal to you will get the answer enjoy substituting x and y values right so I have designed a small excel sheet with the values here and formulas I have given right so x values are here y values are here p stands for pi right so y cos x so you can finally you can easily find this one and this values by just giving y value and x value in your calculator as well as y cos 2x can easily found out using the calculator just substitute y value and x value see here the values are given here this is the summation add all these things this will give the summation of y cos x this will give the values of summation of y cos 2x and so on I have calculated I have made this in the excel sheet okay, let's see how to do this problem practically first reset your calculator okay press 3 to reset the calculator is resetted again now it is in degree mode you can change this to radian mode okay press 2 for radian now the formula here is y cos x so alpha y cos button then alpha press this button you get y cos x use this cal so that it is asking for y value so give your y value if your y value is 1.4 just give 1.4 and press equal to button it's asking for x value and we know very well x value is in radian and it is pi by 3 so shift pi divided by 3 equal to 0 0.6 is our answer suppose if you want to calculate y cos 2x just 
same thing alpha y cos 2 alpha x just press calc it is asking for y value press y 1.4 equal to asking for x value x value is pi by 3 pi divided by 3 this is our y cos 2x like this you can do y cos the place of cos if it is sine you can also same thing you can do alpha y sine alpha x calculate y value is 1.4 give 1.4 press equal to button press x value x value is pi by 3 shift pi divided by 3 you can also do for y sine 2x alpha y sine 2 alpha x this is formula is fixed now we can press this calculate just substitute y value 1.4 equal to x value pi divided by 3 so it gives your y sine 2x this is how we work with simple calculation thank you